Hey guys, welcome back. Some more Persona 5. And in this episode, it's time to infiltrate the bank. Take down Kanashiro. But before we do that, um... On, we kinda gotta take you off the team. No offense, you're just... <laughs> really not gonna help us in this next specific scenario. What the dump? I did not even know this was a thing! Is there another one over there? Oh my god, they're all over! Why does this guy have god dang giant piggy banks? I'm there's even trees of money. God dang, I love this game. Yeah. That's one heck of a pig. I doubt it's for collecting money, so why is a pig decorating the entrance? I don't know, it kinda sure is a pig. Maybe that's why. Back to where we were saying, Morgana. Buddy, pal, it's been a while. We actually need you on the team instead of on. Trust me, you're gonna be glad you did this a little bit later, but yeah, now that we got that taken care of, it's time to go inside and on, poor Makoto. It's probably a lot to take in all at once, huh? My mind is made up. Let's go inside. Wow, she's taking this a lot better than I would be in this scenario, but... Yeah, she's right. Enough stalling. Let's head inside. What business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. No, no, wait! She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Let him pass! That voice... It's Kaneshiro. You mean a bank has a president? They make good money. Yusuke, you make a great point. I gotta say that thinking is pretty concrete and... Please wait. Uh, okay. Reception's further in. To the right. Strongly advise that you not attempt to go elsewhere. Okay, we'll behave and... Seriously, get a look at this place. It looks like a church in a way. All the ATMs are on their pews, just waiting, I guess, to make a deposit. Jeez, this place is pretty messed. Oh, there's even a receptionist. There's real people here? What the? Is this how Kaneshiro sees his, like, lackeys? Uh, maybe, but, well, I guess there's really only one way we can go right now. Might as well comply and see the president. Reception's just past this door. Alright, we'll behave. We'll go straight through this door. Just kidding! <laughs> Oh, yeah, everybody's looking at us. Probably a bad idea to attempt that right now. Where's Makoto? Okay, she's right there. Man, I love this music. I know all the music in Persona is good, but this is one of the best tracks in Shepson's to the right. Don't go anywhere else. Shut the dump up. I'll do what I please. Incredible. Except right now, and this place is gigantic. Well, I guess anything goes in the palace, yeah. Giant floating bank. Not gonna lie, I did not see that uh, coming at all. This is the reception office. We're on inside. All right, all right. We are guests here, though. I'd appreciate a little bit more politeness and... What the heck? Oh my gosh, look at all that cash! How many Legos do you think I could buy with that? Hmm. How many beef balls could I eat with this? Unauthorized entry, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to three million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? It must be quite a tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. You gonna call it off then? No, a loan. The interest rate is 10% a day. 10% interest a day? Um, uh, that means uh, one day is. It's 300,000 yen. There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. 
My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are so useful. They lack physical strength and are dumb. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kaneshiro! We're gonna snatch your treasure from you! Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. Alright boys, here we go. It's time to take down the Onis, and these guys are a little bit on the tough side, so we're gonna have to be careful. Now, what I like to do here is use multi-targeting magic attacks to try and take care of them. However, if you have any crowd control, such as brainwash, you know, fear, all those status effect moves, they're also fantastic here, but since Morgana technically has the highest magic, we're gonna prioritize him and get that attack up. Now we have to pray and hope that we get a freeze. If we can't... Ooh, that's not looking good. Alright, we'll work around it. Come on, Magaru. Deal some damage. Nice! That was really good. Okay. Unfortunately, yeah, that rampage is gonna sting. Oh man, we didn't dodge it. No, Morgana! Crap, that is really bad. Alright, we gotta get a heal out of him next time. Um... Yeah, I know. Okay. Let's use the blessed damage again. That did pretty decent. I also recommend bringing Ryuji in here, since his Tarakaja will spread over into the next battle, and yeah, just a word of warning, this isn't the only fight you're gonna have against these guys, so be prepared. That should do it, though. Nice. The first squad's been taken down! Send it back up! The target is still alive! We must deal with them at any cost! God dang, can't catch a break. Here come more. Now, for a majority of these battles, we've just been able to abuse the fact that our main character does a ton of damage with physical attacks, but unfortunately, yeah, we kind of can't rely on that here since physical attacks just completely do nothing to these guys. It's not completely nullified, but it does not do nearly as much damage as it should. I'm not going to waste a healing item here. That'd be kind of a waste. Let's actually go for Rampage. That might do decent damage, if not be... Oh no, a miss. And did one hit. God dang it. Ryuji, we needed you here. God, all right, whatever. Work around it. Oh my, no. They're so fast. This is so bad. We gotta go for the Medea. That's the only way. Come on, we just gotta tank another turn. This is actually really tough for the first, like, step in Akanashiro's palace. I gotta say. Okay, good. We did take a lot of damage there. And Yusuke. Yes! He tanked it. Nice. So, I'm 100% sure we can finish the fight now. We just needed to... No, we missed again! God dang it! Why are these Onis so god dang fast? Alright, whatever. Well... Just even it out a bit. Use the Zeo. Nice. So now, just use Mabufu. Come on. Please finish up. Okay, good. Now there's just one more target. Going for the Lucky Punch will be so risky. I'm not about that life. Nice. We finished him off. The target is currently stuck here. We need more backup. Don't let them escape. We must take them down. What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. Let's run! We just faced the power of money firsthand. God dang! We gotta get the heck out of here! We can't fight any more Onis. I mean, we could, but it's kind of bad. And why did the security guards turn into monsters? Or are those supernatural powers? Those have been the personas you mentioned? Well, you does now really look like the time to be asking that? Heck, no it doesn't. We need a retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't get separated from us. Yeah, that'd be really bad. Joker. Hurry, Joker. The exit's just over there. Alright, I'm on it. But before we do head over there, make sure you heal up. It's gonna save you a big headache. Can't stress that enough. But yeah, let's get the heck out of here. There's no end to them! Guys! You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro! Those would be my words. 
However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough. That's why I make it a case to kill troublesome customers. Having one impertinent brat disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please stop! I'll eliminate others besides my goods. You've no need to worry. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful. If only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then! <laughs> I've been listening to you go on and on. Shut your damn mouth, you money grubbing asshole! <gasps> Have you decided to tread the path of strife? Yes. Come to me! Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. What the hell? No, dude. It's a bike! I can feel it. Myself. Me! Got it! <laughs> wow! Nice! What is that? I've never seen anything like it. <clears throat> you better earn your keep, or else I'll kill you! I will not lose heart again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non-stop. Right, Johanna? <laughs> Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice! Let's go, Johanna! Full throttle! The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening! Now's Makoto's chance to shine. God dang, that was sick! But Makoto is unique in the sense that she has access to nuclear damage, which is gonna tear these guys up. So, every turn you have her, go ahead and spam Mafrey. It's gonna do so much damage. Speaking of which, we really don't want to use Matadora's attack here. Let's go for Makame and actually just keep hitting the center Oni for massive amount of damage. That's the Best way to survive here, and here comes the Mabafula, a second tier mad. Oh my gosh, no. Ryuji's frozen, that's really bad. Using Ice here would be really bad since that Oni does a lot of ice damage and absorbs it too. So let's buff up Makoto and please tank it. Okay, the tech did decent damage. Now we just gotta absorb this rampage. Come on. Oh my gosh, it did nothing. Ryuji, sick. Okay, this is really looking good. Now we're gonna go into Ryuji, buff up the student council president even more. Get her attack as high as it can go, and then unleash two more Mafrays. This is how the battle should go, and if you have On on your party, things can get a little bit on the rough side, but if you keep exploiting the center shadow's weakness, you should be fine. And well, there's just one left. Makame's not as cool as a motorcycle, but he'll get the job done. Now, let's get out of here!
we know how to get in now. Our objective's been accomplished. But how are we getting out? There's only one exit, right? Sup, Miss Post-Apocalyptic Raider. Do you want to get smacked? I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Get in! So you'll stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. There's no escape in reality, nor will you break through the security system here. There's not a snowball's chance in hell that a bright future lies ahead for you. Man, talk about wild! That was no Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. I am so not pissing her off. Feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. Oh, stop it. This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years. But it felt pretty great. I never thought I'd become part of the Phantom Thieves I was after. Sis might faint if she found out. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the Phantom Thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, it must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but... There are times I feel sorry for her, too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system, too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great! We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. So the girl who's blackmailing us kind of just saved her butt. It's pretty rad, Makoto. And dang, motorcycles are cool! I wish my persona was like that. You got a pirate ship for you, you don't need one. Yours is on a ship, though. Dude, your motorcycles are way cooler than dumb boats! Like, it's like the song, I'm a phantom on a steel horse I ride. Don't say such things. For the record, I'm most certainly not wanted. Honestly, I'm mostly just surprised you know how to ride a motorcycle at all, Nijima-senpai. Uh, do you get a license? <laughs> a regular one. Yes. Nice! Can't wait to get my hands on one, too. That aside, mind if I change the topic for a moment? What is the matter? I'm sorry, everyone. I know I'm not in any position to be saying that. I truly do. However, I must apologize. It was my actions that dragged all of you into this mess. On top of that, I misunderstood your true intentions in this. If only I could have realized 
what was happening to Suzui san ah, Come on. We don't need to talk about that now. Seems there are still some lingering issues on everyone's minds. Now, it's not the time to be talking about that crap, though. So we gotta be doing something about Kaneshiro? He's right. Very well. I understand. Anyway, I'll do my best to make sure I don't slow you all down. Well, with your motorcycle, I don't think that'll be a problem. And, well, we were at odds with each other just a while ago. Well, you're just totally right. I know, that's pretty rare. We need to work together to overcome this. Heck yeah, we do! I mean, when you think about it, we kind of have to be thankful for Makoto. She got us as far as like we'd ever been. I mean, God, she didn't show up. We might not have found his hideout at all. And Makoto seems like she'll be a reliable advisor. But now we're going up against a real criminal. Stay on your toes. Yeah, but... Man, you just gotta think, if Makoto didn't just act so rash and reckless, like... Will we've ever found Kaneshiro's palace? Like... I don't know, man. We gotta thank her for that. Even though she tried to blackmail us, but now we have a new dilemma on our hands. Those pictures get leaked. Uh, we are not gonna... We're gonna get kicked out of school, basically. So we're pretty much still on a deadline, and... So, the palace is a bank this time. Should make a worthy target. I know what you're really after, Morgana. You just want to steal the goddamn money there. I don't blame you. But I'll have to, well, happen later. Looking forward to seeing how things will go with our new member. As am I. But god dang, I'm beat from fighting Onis. Let's get some sleep. A motorcycle-shaped persona, huh? You know, I can turn into a car too, so it's like... I feel a sense of familiarity? You better not throw up in me! Well, motorcycles are nice too, but it can't carry large numbers of people. I really am special after all. Huh? Carry? No. Take somewhere? Something just crossed my mind. It's no use. I can't remember at all. <sighs> eh, there's nothing I can do about it if I can't remember. I need to concentrate on Kaneshiro for now. Unlike you guys, Makoto's clever, so we can expect great things from her. But man, you really do have something special. Looks like I better step up my game too. All right. I know. After we deal with Kaneshiro, I should consult her about mementos, too. I'm sure Makoto's brain can... Hello? Ugh. We got Yusuke, and now Makoto. This guy has quite the luck. Could there be some reason for it? Nah, that can't be. Animal Buddies with Existential Crises! Oh, hey, Makoto. What's up? Good morning. I've been thinking a lot about personas and palaces since yesterday, as I'd imagine anyone would. That floating bank really reflects Kaneshiro's personality. He's flying around so no one can trace his steps. He doesn't trust anyone. <sighs> Best security is tight in there, too. Eh, we'll get past it. Don't sweat it. That's why we should get moving soon. Why don't we go to the palace today? <sighs> About that... Maybe later. That's cool with you. <laughs> Understood. I'm sure you have your reasons as the leader. Yeah, I gotta go buy bio-nutrients from my plant. Leave my schedule open after school, so talk to me anytime. Okay! I mean, you have my number, which you got by finding my address. I don't know, man. Makoto, I'm glad she's on the team. I'm glad she's going to help us fight shadows, but she's still a little creepy. At the end of the day, and wait, what's this? Sorry for asking you here like this. Oh, no. It isn't a problem. I actually find it refreshing to be asked to the student council room. Uh, what's going to happen? And Although it's somewhat nerve-wracking as well. <laughs> I think I'm a bit nervous myself. Hmm. Uh, about what? Anyway, um... 
I wanted to apologize. Uh, I'm really sorry for everything. Wait, what? She's apolog- um, I thought you were mad at Makoto. What? What do you mean? You know how I blamed you for Kamoshida's sexual harassment? Well, I want to apologize for that. I've honestly been meaning to this whole time. It's a comic-y son. I mean, you didn't have to apologize and do much, right? And I realized later that Shiho was calling out for me. I wasn't there to help her. I didn't want to admit my own guilt, so I took it on you, <laughs> Nijima Senpai. I'm very sorry. Oh. Well, that's not a bad reason to apologize. <sighs> There's no need for that. Yeah, the bowing's a little much, and in fact, I think the two of us are pretty similar. Huh? <laughs> I wasn't able to save anyone. Not Suzui san and not any of Kanashiro's victims. I kept telling myself I wasn't at fault. Because I simply was following orders. That was all a lie. Oh, that's how you really feel. It felt like I'd be admitting my own worthlessness had I not shifted the blame off of myself. Fear of that worthlessness was probably why I acted so harshly towards you and your friends. Oh, yeah, you've had it pretty rough too. I'm deeply sorry as well. Well, hey, it's good you're both apologizing. I see. Huh. In that case, wanna call it even? <laughs> Just water into the bridge like that. Even? <laughs> you're right. How about we have this conversation in the past? Yeah, you can both move on, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, but one more thing. You're not worthless, Nijima Senpai. Oh really? Go on. I love a compliment and you're a bit reckless, but you're the reason we found a way into Kanashira's palace. Yeah. You're not that's pretty helpful in my opinion. You can obtain the power to change people's hearts. You do that all yourself, Nijima Senpai. <laughs> that way of thinking is very much like you, Takamaki san. You could have just said, aw thanks. You didn't have to say that and when you confronted me about Suzui-san, I realized how dishonest and small I was. You're always very direct. That's what helped me finally realize the error of my ways. Oh, I guess you both helped each other out. Turns out I'm a little slow on the uptake at times. Hey, can I call you on? Oh, first name basis already. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna do the same... Oh, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> How about we go get something before we go home for the night? Wait, school's not over, it's just lunchtime. Uh, I know a place. There's a crap shop at the Central Street. Ah, uh, that totally stuffs their craps. Do you, you want to split one? Mmm, let's each get a whole one and then go half half on those. <laughs> that is so like on. Well, shall we? Man, I like it when like, the Persona games actually have, like, character interaction that isn't, like, you know, just the main character talking to somebody. That's so important to show, and I realize this is might be late, but how shall I refer to you, Nijimasa? I believe some courtesy should be shown to those who are our senior. Oh, uh, yeah, I called you Nijimasan or, like, Nijimasenpai? No need to be formal. Just treat me the way you would anyone else. Okay! Sounds good to me. I don't, I don't have preference and... Will that not be rude? I don't just call her by name. <gasps> For real? Something happened? That's a secret between us girls. Oh, dang it. That sounds like fun. <laughs> All of you may call me by my first name. No need to hesitate. Okay, that's pretty cool. Very well. I shall do just the same. So that's like not a big deal in America. Because, you know, we call each other by our first name, but that's relatively uncommon when, you know, not really good, good friends with people okay. in Japanese, like, schools and stuff. Just throwing that out there, and our next target is a criminal nine the police can handle. We gotta be careful and leave the world speechless. Also, we have a new deadline. Cool. And now the real mission will start. I like how I threw a little bit of a curveball in the beginning with, like, Makoto. Also, the game's gonna tell you two months in... Hey, you should probably do confidants and make sure Pristona's stronger. Hey. It's like we haven't already doing that for like 60 days. <laughs> Anyways, before we do anything else today, I need to hit up the underground mall, specifically the flower shop. Now, kindness is a very difficult thing to obtain. Also, hi on, bye on, I uh, will see you in a bit, but uh, before we do, I need to talk to the flower shop owner. Also, we got a job here, but we're not gonna do that for like a while. 
It's, you know, it's easier ways to get kindness, what can I say? Anyways, we're not gonna work, because that'd be a giant waste of our afternoon, and instead buy six bio-nutrients. If you're a little bit low on cash, and I'm just gonna like, be barely cutting it, because we're gonna be calling Kawakami like over like four more times, I think, but maybe a little less. Get as many as you need. You're not gonna need more than six if you're following this playthrough. Anyways, on, don't worry about the treasure, we'll find it. God, don't sweat it. I guess this is still better than you know, past Persona games where you just couldn't do anything while you had an objective. But anyways, we're actually gonna not take on on like a like date. Let's just go somewhere fun. Nah, really, we're just you know. Let's just go to the park. The first time we hung out with On, might as well. Well, technically we met her at the diner, but you know what I mean. That was the like first confidant with the lovers, and this place is really an oasis right in the middle of the city. I can feel the trees energy. That's called oxygen. Huh? <laughs> I honestly enjoy just relaxing like this. Yeah, it's not bad. Makes me think of a picnic. Now I'm craving sandwiches. Uh, well, next time we can make some for each other and have a little picnic. That'd be fun, right? <gasps> Friendship sandwiches, though. I mean, just being clear. And it's okay if they're the sweet kind with whipped cream and custard inside. Not what I was thinking, but nah, anything for you. And anyway, it's really quiet here. You know, though we're usually everything everywhere's pretty quiet. I know. Let's take a walk. I wanna see what else is around. Wanna come with? Of course. I mean, I wanna came all this way if I didn't want to hang out with you on and our relationship will deepen soon. And we'll fuse better persona of the Lover's Arcana. You know, I'm probably never gonna fuse Lover's Arcana persona. I think I'll fuse like one Brain. in my playthrough of like all of the persona games. I'll see yeah. You're getting a few customers because of the rainy season. Or maybe your cafe sucks. Hmm. There's been no sign yet of Kanashiro acting on his threat. Probably thinks his money's just gonna come rolling in. He does have the upper hand on us, after all. Yeah. That picture got out. Who knows what ended up happening to him. I guess worst case scenario, get expelled. Yeah, let's not let that happen. And no, there's a more serious alternative. He's currently under probation. Meaning... I'm so sorry. This whole situation is my fault. I mean, yeah, but come on, stop that. I mean, you're the one who's in the most trouble right now. Yeah, your picture's pretty bad. My sister's a prosecutor. This will surely be a problem for her as well. What should I do? Kanashiro must surely be taking the aspect into account too. No matter what, we gotta stop him. It's the only way. For sure. He's having trouble with this jerk. We'll be heroes if we catch him. I risk. And I reward. You're also positive. Hmm. In a way, your recklessness is the only reason we are now able to pursue the change of heart. Totally. We're in deep crap, so we gotta do whatever we can to get out of it. I <sighs> never thought of things that way before. I guess it's quite strange hearing something so positive from you, G. <laughs> Shut up. All right, leader. They can decide when we meet up. It's gonna be a while away. Don't even worry about it. And when your position changes, a few worlds, cognitive. Well, God, we already talked about that a million times. God dang, we're really trying to drill in that cognition thing. I see. But anyways, you know the drill by now. Gotta get some coffee. Your real talk. If our main character's drinking this much coffee, like, how does he? Does he ever pee? Cause like in this game, I don't know if you can use the bathrooms. Very curious on that. Let's test that out soon. And I don't have enough money to do what I want. It's been a lot of pictures leaked lately. I guess kind of sure is doing this to everybody. And do a job. It's real easy. Don't fall for it. And so many weirdos lately. It's a psychotic breakout thing. Been hard to meet my quota. Gotta fight some suckers. <laughs> that is the. No one's friends with that Mafia member, because, you know, you, you tell him the slightest joke, and he'll just laugh for like an hour and a half. Actually, I don't know, I like, a, a couple of my friends are like that. They're nice to be around, because I don't know if I'm being funny or not, and they just laugh anyways. It's nice, and you hear there's a famous fortune teller in Shinjuku! Yeah, read something about that online. Beautiful fortune teller or something. Wait a second, wasn't that that girl we just saw the other day that the game forced us to interact with? Because if you didn't, you probably wouldn't even know that you were there and then be like, why the dump? Don't I have any win persona? I hate this game. The answer is yes. It's smart that they do that in a fortune teller in Juku. You see her with that journalist? She seems pretty popular. Yeah, she seems pretty... 
pretty. Smooth. Anyways, today at school, I had to break it to you that like, oh my gosh, all right. Still not my favorite awakening scene, but it was pretty cool. Pretty much all we're doing is reading our phone in Makoto, you okay? Is Kashira threatening you or anything? It's been demanding money, but I choose to ignore those messages. Is that okay? Any scary men showing up at your house? Oh god, that'd be really bad. No. Kanashiro still has the photographs in his possession. Remember? Perhaps that advantage is why he doesn't feel any urgency to act. So, you think we're in the safe for now? Uh, I mean, yeah, but we gotta hope it stays that way. Yeah, I know how you feel. Just like Yusuke said, those pictures are bad news for us. You will need to change Kanashiro's heart as soon as possible. Agreed. I'll do everything that I can to help. Nice. So it's good to see everyone's on the same page, and yeah, it's pretty unanimous we need to stop him because Yusuke doesn't want to get, you know, his scholarship terminated, kicked out of his art school. That would suck for him. Same for Makoto, and oh, want to go to the palace? <sighs> respond when you see this. Oh man, so put... <laughs> I, I mean, I'm gonna respond if I see it. I'm, I'm not gonna, we're not gonna go today, but I will respond and I have the luxury of taking over time anymore. The picture gets out. It'll get you guys in trouble, too. It's fine. Just take care of some student council things. I'll be in the student council room if you change your mind. Okay, I won't. So I'm gonna go dork around my friend Ryuji because bonds are important. And also, it is like... It is so important to just dork around. Can we just talk about that real quick? Like, sometimes you just need to, like, not worry about crap. Just take your mind off it. You right. can't always... Be focused on your goals no matter what. Now I know I'm probably preaching to the choir, but this is something I often forget and eh, yeah, it's gonna hurt to change of pace. Right. Yeah, exactly. Yo, someone wanna talk to you about. It's gotta do with the track team. Does man hear me out? As long as it's over some delicious food, dude, just talk about whatever the dump you'd right, like. Let's go. You're a lifesaver, dude. I mean, I've been told that before and feeling real hungry, so let's get something good. Oh man, my stomach is crazy. Oh, all right, this episode needs to hurry up. Man, I'm stuffed. Ugh. Pretty dang good, huh? This one's on me. I don't expect it to happen too often. <laughs> all right, man. Wait. Where's my wa- Uh-oh. Eh, whatever. I don't know, man. You should probably find your wallet. Hey. Oh, by the way. I got a text from Takeshi. Wait, really? So the track team's gonna try and ditch Yamauchi. Then we'll start practicing without him. Trying to get their old coach back, too. The one before Kamoshida. Oh, yeah, I remember, man. Looks like they're finally walking their own path. Yeah, feels good to be free, huh? Are you satisfied now, though? Can we stop worrying about the track team, worry about ourselves? Hmm? Oh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, that's pretty much what you wanted, right? Actually. Mm. Oh, and, uh... Ask me to come back to the team. Wait, really? Well, I mean, you don't gotta go, man, if you don't wanna go. Don't feel pressured. It's not a big deal. Dude, I wasn't gonna. Felt kind of bad, but that's not where I belong now. Yeah, you want to be free, right? When you first came to Shujin, people were talking so much crap about you. Trust me, I know. But you took it in stride. You just did whatever you thought was cool and didn't care what other people said about you. Yeah, that's what being cool is all about. and I mean, That's why people kind of get pulled towards you, man. Maybe. Maybe it's the wild card. Maybe you decide to be, and that's where you belong. Huh. I didn't realize that before, man. You make a good point. Just write a book and... Uh, seriously? <laughs> you know, back when I met you, I kept making excuses for why I couldn't fit in. You know, it was always because of someone else. Kamoshida, the track team. Heck, I even blame my dad. I was such a freaking loser. Come on, man, don't be hard on yourself. I realize now, as long as I'm being myself, I always have somewhere I could fit in. It ain't really the same place as before, but it's dang good. I'm just glad I found it. Man, I'm happy you found it too, dude. Man, pretty cool, Ryuji. <laughs> don't worry, man. There's a place for you too. Right next to me. Or maybe head. Something like that. <laughs> that doesn't really matter, man. It's so cool to see Ryuji grow a lot, I mean. Granted, his character doesn't progress like, WHOA! But it's like, yeah man, I don't need the track team. 
I don't always need to fit in. Where I am, that's where I belong, you know? That's not bad. I ain't gonna stop training, though. I still got a long way to go. Heck yeah, you do. Someday, I'm gonna share your speed so lightning fast, you're not gonna be able to see me. Wait, are you the Are you Barry Allen, Ryuji? What? Did you just... Anyways, wait. You can't see me? Am I really showing you anything? <laughs> Guess not. Eh, whatever. I think we're not talking too long. We're out of manja. <laughs> Try grilling some toothpick. I mean, we could just order more. Oh, wait, back? you don't have your wallet. Crap. Bro, you should probably find that. Anyways, yeah, I don't know. Some people say Ryuji's character doesn't progress a whole lot. I don't think it really needed to. Uh, then back. again, I'm ultra biased, and popular fortune teller must have the same one that predicted horrible misfortunes for Ryuji, right? She must have some kind of trick. Maybe we should check it out. Good idea, but I'm gonna do that probably later, cuz... I wanna test out those bio-nutrients. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, it's actually time to feed our plant again. I know. It's like I have a calendar for this crap, so I don't forget. Anyways, you wanna do this as soon as you can. You know, if you're off by a day, it's not gonna kill you or anything, doesn't eat up time, but yeah. Just make sure you use those. Anyways... God dang, Makoto! She sure showed up. Helped us out a lot against Kanashiro's minions. I mean, god, those Onis are tough. So, it's pretty safe to assume that this next palace is gonna be a little bit trickier than the art museum. But you know what? With our new student council president at our side, I'm sure we'll do just fine. Anyways, see you guys in the next episode of Persona 5, where we begin to prep for the palace infiltration. Thanks for watching, and see you guys then. Bye.